Um, I don't know what day it is. Day before Christmas Eve, Friday morning. And then we we're uh, quicker than Campberg, a little bit quicker than Group Farmer, and a like half an hour, uh, not an hour quicker than Telly. On board Abu Dhabi Ocean Racing, today's the day to dry out and clean up. Because of the stealth zone, we can't show you where the boats are geographically, but we can show you where they are in relation to one another. As predicted, the doldrums have brought lighter winds and the fleet has compressed. A lateral spread could provide the chasing boats with new tactical opportunities and cause some concern for the leaders. On board second place Telefonica, skipper Ica Martinez and watch leader Jordi Califat search for an advantage in every cloud. Yesterday we met the pitmen aboard Camper and Group Armour. Today it's Puma's Ryan Godfrey who describes his role on Mar Mostro. I guess in terms of being busy, the, the imports are probably the hardest for me. Um, you know, the courses are really short, so um, just just that entire race. I mean, particularly on a run, you know, um, from the time of hoisting the chute and, and dropping the jib, and you, you know you have to run the halyard because. Uh, you have a whole bunch of rope, which if you get a tangle in it at the bottom mark, isn't ideal. So um, the, the whole import race is flat out. Christmas at sea is a new one for the camper crew. Uh, most importantly, you're probably thinking about your uh, loved ones and uh, everything back home and what they're doing. And they're never, uh, never far from your thoughts, but especially on uh, days like Christmas Day. Again, it would be nice to be with family and friends at home, but uh, we're not. We're out here on the water, so you make the best of it and, and uh, keep racing. You know, there's still a, a lot of uh, racing to be done on this race course. Group Armour's skipper, Frank Camas, is 39 years young today. Ian Walker, struggling with the smell on Azam, has the last word.